Hey everybody, how goes it? My name's Jamor, and welcome back to Horizon Zero Dawn The Frozen Wilds. This was a pain to get up to. An absolute pain. The secret is a little pass in between here and some very, very particular platforming. Or more like climbing, because sometimes she just does not want to do it. Drove me nuts getting up here. But it's the last one. Dark really? crystal. Cool. Matt. Let me get back to him. Since I don't feel like waiting through a cutscene, I'm gonna see if I can find a way down. This should work. Quick way down. Yep. And we're down. All that climbing, just for that couple of seconds of dropping. Whatever. Okay, anyway, here's the lodge I was telling you about. I'm gonna quick save just because. Then. Where's the guy at with his little hologram? Here it is. Yeah, right. Now, as you can see, he doesn't have it activated. Where is the bear? There's the bear. Right here. Okay, I, I could do this. Ursus Americanus. Oh, it's loud. A magnificent American black bear. Brought to you by Montana Recreations. How would you like to find yourself cornered by that thing? I suspect I'd like it very much indeed. What a beautiful beast you were. Yeah, this, this is the guy. Do I place him or do I give him to him? Give him to him. Back again, Enjuk. You've picked up my interest in the beasts of the old world, I see. Yes. There you go, Enjuk. That should be the last of the figurines. That's all of them. Guy. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And thank you. And thanks some more. And one more time. Thanks a bunch. Right. I didn't know if I'd ever see the whole collection reunited. <laughs> and look at them. They're beautiful. You've done a great thing, Aloy. These may represent the last record that any of these beasts ever lived. Take this. It's the least I can do. And come back any time. I and our animal friends await your return. Thank you. You say about a Montana. Great man made these figurines. Indeed, he was, I believe, a student of the natural world, like me, but surpassing my abilities a thousand times over. The great Montana recreations, <laughs> perhaps the finest natural scholar the old world ever produced. His voice claims responsibility <laughs> for the totems, the vessels for the knowledge he accumulated. I share his desire to understand the beasts, to catalog their behaviors and preserve mm -hmm. their images. I like to flatter myself that I'm an apprentice of sorts, carrying on his work. Someday, sure. perhaps, if I am persistent, I can earn his name, Enjuk Recreations. <laughs> <laughs> That's all for now. Until next time, then. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Let's see what we got here. Puma Concalor, the fearsome cougar. Oh, Brought to you by Montana Recreations. It's coat of sand colored. Could it have been a burrowing animal? Perhaps those teeth were only used for digging. Right. Next. I see a brown bison, bear. Bison, bison, bison. That's the actual Latin name of the regal American bison. Brought to you by Montana Recreations. Latin?
Perhaps that's some sort of old world custom in which one repeats the name <laughs> of a particularly revered animal. These are funny. Brown bear. Ursus Arctos. Man, he's a menacing big. grizzly bear. Brought to you by Montana Recreations. Those claws look like they could rip someone in half. Perhaps in its youth, but you heard Montana Recreations. He said it's grizzled. <laughs> its hunting days are behind it. Ah, oh, dude. Here's something else. Here we have Help. Here. The majestic mule deer. Mule deer. Brought to you by Montana Recreations. Not built like a predator, but perhaps it needed those horns to take down its prey in the absence of sharp fangs. Sure, let's go with that. Wolf. And then moose. Canis lupus. The enigmatic gray wolf. Brought to you by Montana Recreations. Could it be that these wolves, now are foxes, are the same somehow? Perhaps after hundreds of winters. No. No, that's. That is ridiculous. And the moose. Alsus, Alsus. The noble moose. Brought to you by Montana Recreations. The horns grow like trees. Of course, this. Moose used those bizarre growths to blend in with its forest home. Huh. Yeah, you have fun with that. I'm gonna take this box. Thank you. Moving on. Now, this one I am gonna fast travel to. Also, I need to get rid of that. Uh, yes. Okay, where's dude I'm talking to? You are. Hey, you're back. I still don't like you. My Len has returned. I expect you have something to say about this. I do. Then convince me what an outlander's word is worth. Uh. uh let's see. Rose of the Ordeal, she survived. She I'm not that. up on all of the Banuk traditions, but I know what matters to you is that your laws are upheld. Going by the rules of your ordeal, she endured the four days and the four nights. She faced the extremes and survived. Seems to me that's what you wanted. Just so. Then by the law, my Len will wear our paint. Outlander. So nothing of the other hunter? The one called Ikri? She's... gone. She sounded brave. Her name will always be in my song. I still don't like you. Okay. I got some stuff. I've never traveled further south than the Greek. So let's see what's in these boxes, shall we? Please. Blue gleam, badger bone, metal burn. Blue gleam, squirrel bone, echo shell. Ooh, look at that. Ancient sculpture. I guess I just sell that? Yeah. Fifty-one percent damage. Now we're talking. That goes on this one, right? No, it goes on the other one. That's weird. This doesn't do freeze damage, though. Uh, this one. Yes. I don't know why it has that. It just doesn't do shock and freeze, which is weird. A better damage coil. Uh, ba -da -ba. 41, 41, 3, 43. Anybody else? You do. 
Okay. In the old days, the mad Sun King made doing so impossible. Stone Yield deserved better than those wretched parasites. Good for you. I'm proud of you. Don't know what we're talking about, but sure. Go on back here. Is this what you- Hush, hush! A shaman's secrets are not spoken aloud. Is this what you wanted me to find? Find it to your spear. Use it to attach this for now. You'll find more, I'm sure. Why are you helping me? The blue light is fading. The machine songs are ending. And, and what does the conclave do? They sit, they chant, they observe. No more. We must fight for it. And you? You are a fighter. We share a cause. I'm not sure we do. I'm not even sure what the cause is. But I'm grateful. No need for thanks. Only action. Now I can attach modification parts to my spear. Works for me. Might as well yeah. get started improving my spear. Yeah, yeah. Not bad. What if I went... I could put two on here? Oh, I'm getting damaged the shit out of things. Just wait till I get another purple one. Yeah. I get another one now? No. Roll. I got a mission up here. We got dude to buy stuff from. But first, I'm gonna have to talk to my painter lady. Whatever new machine you call from that cauldron. A little business arrangement. Hey, it's Duder. Hi. Lady, you have got to be freezing. What is wrong with you? What do you have? Anything worthwhile? Nope. No. Nope. 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 Nothing worthwhile. What's up, dude? What can I do for you, Burgund? Mourn my poor departed luck. I finally met some Banuk keen to trade with outlanders. Then, they up and vanished. Three Banuk hunters rolled in a few days ago. No provisions, junk equipment, no idea how to strip a machine for parts. Asked me to outfit them for a long trip. And you know me, Aloy. I'm sentimental. So... I did it on credit. And they haven't paid. Well, they tried. Just look what they did to this Thunderjaw heart. But that was ages ago. And I'm starting to worry about them. Okay. Tell me, Burgrind, are you worried about their well-being or your purse strings? A man can worry about two things. Uh-huh. What kind of deal was this really? Just what I said. I was nothing but generous, Aloy. After they dropped this ruined heart at my feet, I even gave them another chance. Sent them to fetch a few other parts I need. But you haven't seen them since. <laughs> Hide nor hair. Okay. What do you mean they couldn't harvest parts? Not uncommon with Banuk. That's shaman's work, you see. The hunters take down the machines. The shamans slice them up. No shaman with these three. Just two youngsters sniping at each other. And that big fella. Standing there smiling. So if the Banuk don't usually hunt without a shaman, what's the story with these three? Mm -hmm. They weren't telling. But hammer to steel is not a happy story, whatever it is. You said they asked you to outfit them for a trip. A trip to where? Not sure. But I heard them chattering about the Sundom when they thought I wasn't listening. So they're leaving Banuk territory. Sensible behavior. Still, I get the sense this wasn't a sightseeing trip. They're running from something. Okay. I'm not a debt collector, Burgrind. If I look for them, it'll be to make sure they're all right. Of course, of course. Fires of the Forge, forgive me. I actually like these idiots. The molten steel of youth and all that. But uh, if you do manage to find them, you could remind them of the deal we made. <laughs> A Scorcher Claw, a loop of sinew from a Stalker, and a Snap Morphine. If they bring me those parts, their debt's paid. And then some. 
Just make sure they don't bust them up too badly. I'll consider it. Last I saw them, they were heading northeast. Good machine hunting up that way. If you decide they're sure. worth the trouble, you might look for them there. These new machines like all machines. Sure. Now I need to make the climb up to my friend. Which, as we all know, is an absolute blast. Come on. Come on. Give me a break. I literally can't go there. That's stupid. I'm stuck. Remember what sort of challenge they present. I heard of a shaman. <laughs> we all still remember the ravenous tribe. The light. Should have made that. The torment walks free. Yep, I did that. You're welcome. Okay, how do we get up here again? This way. This way, over here, there. Where is she at? She's up more, right? There she is. No. Hello, I have your things. Is this swing, or is it just me? The wood bends with the wind. Lean into it. Lean into it. Hey, you see this hall neck. Sure. said you two were friends. I paint about what I feel now, not the way things used to be. Aurea understood. Most Banuk didn't. I would have been exiled if she hadn't had Aratok take me into their Werak. Okay. Here you go. Would you look at that, Nora girl? You've bought me all I need. Do you always travel with your pockets full of paint stuffs? <laughs> Maybe. Honestly, Sakuli, I go around filling my pockets with most of everything. Stop, stop. I'm beginning to like you. I work alone, but come back around later, and I'll have something for you then. That's me. Maybe it's a machine rider who looks like you. <laughs> That's cool. Where is she going? You tell me. To ruins or mountains, through flood or thaw, past, future, destiny. But I don't think she's scared of any of it. You help me inspired me and the people of the cut let this be inspiration for you wherever you may run once the werak gets a glimpse at sakuli's mural word will get around about how i helped her so that's it nothing more i can do to get people talking that's pretty cool spirit Artok's feet that's pretty neat let's see what i got nope maybe blue gleam that'll burn Painted weapon coil. What does that one use? What do we got? No. Uh, oh. uh, maybe. Yeah, it's not bad. Can I put it on this one? It's actually worse, so never mind. Alright, see if we get these outfits. Got them all. Landed. Hi, what's up? We run into each other again. If I didn't know any better, I'd think you were following me. Uh-huh. Sure, you think that. 
I've never traveled further south than the grave. In the old Hello. I can only get one of these. Might as well get this one. Don't equip it. Just buy it. The mad sun king may doing so in Shall we all die beneath it? Alright, time to save and toss my uber powerful spear. No one hunts like the Banuk, but I've heard the Nora can handle their bows. Good to see you, faithful friend. You're uh you're not gonna like what I'm about to do. My people have been telling tales of your accomplishments. Seems you have taken a special interest in our stretch of snow out yonder. Yes. And apparently this is the only way I'll get to see all of it. Is this a challenge? For the Warrack. You? <laughs> this must be a joke. It is not a joke, Eratok. How are you not cold? Now I see. The Outlander's your pawn. And with you backing her claim, I have no choice but to accept. Nobody else is paying attention. I expected better of you, sister. It was you who forbid me from Thunder's drum, brother. Brother and sister? This is a little more complicated than I thought. No, it's simple. You will meet me at the Frost Figures, and I'll put a quick end to this mockery. Right. I suppose I owe you an explanation. Yeah. Yeah. I suppose you do. So, why didn't you tell me that you and Aratok are siblings? I thought I wouldn't have to. I'm surprised Aratok brought it up in front of a stranger. He must be very angry. I'm not always the best judge of people. I prefer the company of spirits. They're simply my own. I didn't want you to think of our pilgrimage as some sort of family squabble. It's much more important than that. Okay. It's bold. I'll give you that. Going after your own brother? He gave me no choice. He thinks I'm a child to be shoved to the back of the hunt. He would forbid me from my destiny. And yet... I wonder how heavy those part of me did it headpieces and necklaces are. He always does. Family drama aside, what's this challenge meant to be anyway? You and Aratok will hunt machines at the Frost Figures. The victor will be the fastest. It won't be easy. Nothing about this has been so far. When you meet us at the starting point, I'll tell you more. It will be simpler to explain from the base of the hills. Aurea, it's not about who's related to who. I want to know what's inside Thunder's drum. The spirit, the daemon, and how it all connects to the machines. But if we're gonna go through with this, I need you to be straight with me. I... Underestimating you. And Aratok. I won't make that mistake again. I'll see you at the Frost Figures then. Yay. I think. So, off to risk my life in order to take charge of a Banuke hunting band. Just what I always wanted. Frost Figures. And a free box. Shape. Okay, but where do I go? What is this? Hunters 3. Uh, hunting grounds. Ross figures. Where is my Thunderbird thing? No, wait. Nope, hunting grounds. Oh, let me see. Quest. Way over here. Hey, okay, I'm gonna do this before I end it and then get back into the cut. Holy crap, that is a long way. 
Because I hate fighting these birds. They suck. You know, First thing I'm doing is tying this I thing down. I all this red dust. Well, there's our storm bird. When you're ready, I'll follow up and boom. Right. better but didn't go too bad running low on a uh, blaze again hi got that part you need perfect already got machine oil on my hands Here it is. One Stormbird Talon. Let's do it. I haven't had this much fun in ages. Watch and learn, Aloy. Only, don't stare directly at the sparks. Yeah, I'll go blind. Okay, so I pretty much had to break her in half. But what's a staff? A stick. One thing I like about sticks, you can put them back together however you want. Which you did. This thing looks a whole lot more dangerous. She's better than dangerous. She's a genuine Varja special now. Take good care of her. Will do. What you did to that storm slinger? That was some impressive work, Varja. Hey, it's nothing. I just helped her become what she was always meant to be. They grow up so fast. Varja's a little I've weird. I've got what you asked for. Show me what you had in mind for the Forge Fire. Finally! Was feeling like I neglected her. And that's a little too close to my family life. She's done, and she's yours. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Oh, looks great. I'm going to do everything I you didn't do. I almost expected you to turn it into a burning rope caster or something. Nah, that would she be was awesome. close to perfect from the start. She's a Varja original, after all. Thanks for your work on the Forge Fire. Pleasure. I mean, you couldn't be more of an improvement on her last owner. What a pile of slag he was. Okay, if I goodbye. find anything I think you'd like, I'll be back around. You better. I gotta get our Tox weapon. Okay. I got more tutorials. Yeah. Let's see. Oh, I have two slots in these things now. What do we got? Yes. And handling be much better. The only use is four there. Handling is good. 
you're pretty good. Hey, shoots balls of fire now. That's awesome. That's exactly what I needed. Don't need terror, but it does 74. You need to get a secondary weapon, but you shoot balls of fire now, that's awesome. Long charge time, yeesh. Yep, okay, so I'll have to try that out some other time, and... Fire burst is a whole separate set of ammo. And it's expensive. In carrying capacity. That's all I can afford to make six shots. Holy crap. Alright, well, I'm gonna end this one here. Uh, I'm going to head back to the cut and we'll do the three hunters and then the challenge there and go from there. But for now, I want to thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did enjoy it, hit that like button, subscribe for more. It helps me out a lot. And as always, we're more on the way. Until then, hope you have a good one.